Okay, I'm starting the video. I'm on Cordova. I'm in front of the building at 110 Cordova where they'll be filming the first day on Tuesday. So I'm going to take you on just a video walk through Gastown and show you how close all the other Fifty Shade locations are to this one. It looks like they're totally setting up for tomorrow. They're moving that huge filter screen. They have lights on this parking garage behind me up on top. They have like four or five huge, huge lights up there. That's why the building is all lit up. You can see the reflection in some of the windows of the lights that they're using. And it looks like they're moving that screen into place where they want to put it. They're moving tons of stuff into the building and it's, I can't go in or anything, but this is about as close as I'm going to get. So I'm going to take off around the corner next. They've got some of their trucks parked over here on Columbia, right around the corner. I'm going to head down towards the street where Anna's apartment is. Sorry. No. Here's these two generators I saw when I first got here. I couldn't figure out what they were using them for all the way over here because they're almost a block away. But I followed the lines, the electrical cords. So they're powering up these cords right here. They're going along around here in the alley. And if you look close, you can see they go right up the side of the building. And then I realized when I got around to the front of this parking structure, they've got those huge lights up on top of it. That's what this is powering up. All right, around the corner to Anna's apartment. So this is the corner of Columbia, which goes down to um, Gassy Jack Square and Powell. And her apartment is right down around the corner. Here's her apartment right here. It's at 120 Pal. There's the famous doors where she comes out. And I think right above here is where they're going to be filming indoors for her apartment. Now I'll go turn all the way around. Down the street, it's hard to see down there, all the way down there. And I'm going to come back around this way. And now I'll go back down the block. Next stop is where Jamie goes jogging. It's Christian Gray, and across the street from that is where Dakota went jogging in Gastown, but they never used it in the movie. So I'm going right here in Columbia, 
across pal. You'll recognize the yellow building right off. That's in the background as he goes jogging down the street. Yeah. Filming, you guys being filming. What are you guys filming? Uh, just a student project. Oh, uh, fun, fun, fun. Yeah. Cool. So I'm at the point where they go jogging, and if you look down to the right of this street, you're going to see where the big sign down there, it says Brard Ironworks. Let me see if I can get down there. That's where they filmed, there it is. That's where they filmed the scenes for the um, bar, the drunk bar place. And that's also where they filmed um, Anna's Portland apartment. Here's the yellow building. That's behind Jamie when he goes jogging. And here's where he jogs. This is Alexander in Columbia. So Jamie went jogging on that far side of the street, across the street where the brick building is. And Dakota went jogging. If you want your best picture of Vancouver, I don't know if you know the city. Kind of. You go up here to Main Street and on the bridge. Oh yeah, and the view's the great. Skyline, the ocean, crap park. Thank it's you. Safe. If you go that way and come straight back this way. Yeah. You go that way, it's bullshit that way. It is kind of bullshit that way. <laughs> I agree, I agree. Thank you. Here's where um, Anna went jogging down this way, so I'm going to walk on this path because I haven't got any pictures over here yet before. And over on the other side of the street is where Jamie went jogging. I'm going to cross over to where Jamie went jogging. I think they went in opposite directions. I think he jogged toward Gassy Jack Square and she came from it. This is where Jamie went jogging right along here. And Anna went across the street. These railings right here were, uh, spot I was able to match up with the movie. You see him at one point jog right around these railings. And I think over there is some of the area that you see with I think it's in one of the behind the scenes you see Dakota or some photos with Dakota jogging over there. It looks like a cool place. It's like the more you walk towards Gassy Jack Square and down this way into Gastown where the shops get nicer, the restaurants get nicer. It definitely changes as you walk this way. And at night, all the gas lamps are on. It makes it really cool in this whole area. So coming up across the street is Peckinpah. And that's where they filmed the bicycle scene.
And actually in the clip I saw of Dakota jogging, she was coming from this direction, so you could actually see behind her at one point, you see the Gassy Jack statue. Alexander is like the main street, Gassy Jack Square. If you take it, it takes you straight into downtown. Here's the bike corner. And this view's back where we just came from. Chap always totally intrigues me. Looks, if you were a cowboy, that'd be where you'd want to go. Now we're walking just one block south, and we're going to be at Rainier Provisions, the coffee shop. Here's one of the alleyways. Down here in Gastown, all the buildings have these alleyways behind them. Some are safe, some are not so safe. There's some places, uh, restaurants and clubs that open up from these alleys. So this is taking us back to Cordova Street. And across the street is where I had dinner last night, actually. At Rainier Provisions. There's Rainier Provisions on the corner. It looks like it's all closed back up. Looks like the lights are still on inside a little bit from last night, but otherwise it's all closed back up. And this is back on Cordova. If you take this straight down, you would be down to where they're filming for tomorrow. So that ends it. I'm gonna go get some coffee because it's freezing. 